Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Sumi Candy, and I'm back again with another video. Today, guys, is my moving day, and it's just crazy because, like, I did not like you know plan like I was procrastinating a lot of things, and I didn't pack till last night. And I'm not even done packing. My things are just so crazy. Everything is so messed up right now. But yeah, my mom is helping me out at home, and I'm here to pick up my medication. Um, I have to pick up. I have to fill in my medication. There's something called filling, like when you don't pay full price for your medication, when your insurance refuses to pay full price, so you go for filling, but they pay it later. So I went for a filling, and yeah, I'm actually waiting on my doctor, and also went to like get some. What do you call it again? What do you call it? Some foundation. And my sister who gave me a ride. Um, is down the street. She's getting something for her makeup. She's she would she would give me a ride. She's not not to give me a ride. She's going to take me to my school. I don't know if my dad is going with me, but I'm sure that my my sister, my brother is going with me. My kid brother, because like my we have small cars and my dad's big car, the one you know the family car, the SUV. I don't know. It like it broke or something. I don't know. Like my dad like had a little accident with it. So is in the mechanic uh, and it's not yet fixed but the guy said it will, it will be done this morning i don't know if my dad is going to pick it up if my dad is going to pick it up then my probably my dad is going if probably my dad is going yeah Pro no if my dad is going to pick up the suv right probably my sister will drive the suv and it will fit all my luggages but if not we are going with two small cars my dad will drive one and my sister would drive one i can't drive and even if I can drive, I can't leave the car in the school because freshmen don't take cars. And yeah, I'm standing outside because it's crazy. Like, I look, oh my gosh, my hand in the camera. I look so crazy right now. I don't even look good. Like, I don't want people to be staring at me inside the pharmacy. Like, why is she like this? Why does she have a bonnet? This is a bonnet. This is a Tuesday bonnet. Why is she like this? So, I kind of felt embarrassed. That's why I'm in the field, you know, waiting because I have 18 minutes to go get it. Person giving my medication is not here and yeah they're looking for my food and just like it's just so crazy and my mom is telling me you have to leave in one hour so you get to school on time you know get a nice dump even though they've given me a dump in case they change their mind because they said they might change their mind single room i don't know yet but it's when i get to the school i'll give you guys more updates i haven't taken a shower let's keep them this one ourselves why did she not take a shower before coming out because i had to rush because like if i didn't come on time if I didn't go here in time, my shower takes like forever. I, like I stay long in, in taking a shower. My mom complains about it a lot. Like people complain about it in my family. Oh, you always stay in the shower. So I had to quickly rush to get my medication before people come to the pharmacy and it's crazy before I went in the line, you know, all that. And yeah, before I get started into this video, make sure you give this a big thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to turn on your post notification and follow me on all my social media, on Instagram, on TikTok, on Twitter, so many underscore candy, let's get lit. You guys should stay tuned with me. I'll just, Keep you guys updated when I take a shower, when I'm done packing and everything, and also anything. You know, I don't know what will happen next. I don't know the future, but yeah, you guys should stay tuned. Love you guys. So, guys, I just came out of the place and I'm walking towards my sister's car, and my sister is not even in here right now. But guys, I just like when I was like inside the place, inside the pharmacy. This is so loud. When I was inside the pharmacy, you know how like someone um you sit down and there's a seat beside you so um, my sister was sitting there before she left old man just told me can i uh, is there no one sitting right there so i was like oh since my sister is not coming in and uh, i have a few more minutes before they call my name let me tell him to sit right there so i told him no one is sitting in there he told me excuse me just give me some space like don't even disrespect me like i hate when someone fucking disrespects me like i was just minding my business you know be respectful but he's happy like people start talking back to him like just don't talk to her like that people just like just want to disrespect people but i don't feel okay i wish i talked back but i know i don't have to respond to every negativity i'll see you guys when i get home and get ready because my family they're playing music i know it's noise in my house i believe it's noise in my house right now i'll see you guys when i get ready and tell them to shut up let me record my youtube i'm just kidding you can't tell my mom to shut up i'm just kidding see you guys bye so guys i just came back everything is crazy and my package just came in another package i ordered so many things online 
Okay, I'm excited. Out. So guys, I just finished getting ready and you know the lightning is so bad here right here. But yeah, I just finished getting ready and I'm going to show you guys everything like I still have one more bath inside my room and I'll start taking things downstairs right now because yeah, so many things heavy and I'm just going to take it to the garage and we we'll start driving. I'll see you guys when I set it up in the car, but I'll show you guys how the thing looks like and everything. So guys, this is how the floor looks like. It's like kind of messed up and everything. My H&M bag and everything. I'm going to show you guys where my bus is and everything. That's it. This is my second bus. This is my second bus. Oh no, it's crazy. All right, guys. I'll see you guys in the car. I'm um, in the car, yeah. So guys. Uh, we didn't actually leave immediately like this is like more than six hours later right and i'm still recording because my dad has to fix his car this is my dad's car right and it's crazy because like you could hear my parents in the background they are like looking for a way to you know fix this and like yeah my brother went to buy food snacks because you know we love to eat over here my lashes is about to fall off damn damn the fuck i'm about to pull this shit off or when my sister comes into the car I'm going to take out the uh, and fix it. Other than that, mm, yeah, we'll just be leaving in a few minutes. When my sister is done, you know, she'll be the one to ride with my dad. They will exchange riding. I don't know if they get tired, whichever one, I don't care. I care, but I don't know. Also, guys, I'm already ready. Like, I need them to throw this AC. And I'll see you guys maybe on our way. Oh, yeah. And I'm so happy because, like, my packages, like, five of my packages arrived this afternoon like where's my bag oh i can't bring it out it's already stacked in but five of my packages arrived god is wonderful i was like how do i do this like why do i need like you know why should i order something and they never arrive almost all my packages came in but i still have like is it 10 more packages that hasn't arrived yet but i'm patiently waiting and i know when once they arrive my my mom will send it to me you know mail it to me and yeah I'll see you guys. So guys i just got to my school right now i'm going to check out my dorm to see like the room that i have and i'll see you guys when i'm inside the dorm my car on uh, my my dad's car is right over there see you guys hey guys um i forgot to keep you guys updated in the car when i go to my school when i got inside they couldn't let me in because i haven't taken the corona test at my school but i already to get at home and it was already closed and they asked me to come back the next day I was begging them like where can I keep my stuff you know help me like keep my stuff so I don't have to take everything I came from all the way from DC to Delaware but they refused and I also like they just told me to put my things in the classroom and if my things are stolen it's at my own risk and also they didn't send me an email on time telling me I have to take virus and also they didn't tell me the time I needed to come back to school it was so crazy I'll tell you guys more story time but I'm about to go to bed. I'll see you guys in the morning. I'm so tired. My head is my head is so like full. Alright guys, bye. Hey guys, good morning. I just woke up. I'm about to take my shower and I'll see you guys when I'm done taking a shower. Thank you guys for staying with me. I know this vlog is already getting long, but yeah, I need to go shower. I'm so tired. I just brushed my seats. Well yeah, I'm going to go shower right now. And I'll see you guys when I stay getting ready. Alright. So guys, I actually left the house. I'm in gas station. I forgot to record that. I'm already done because like, I don't know what brought my family here. But yeah, I'm about to hop into the car now. Start recording when I'm inside the car. I'm tired. Bye.
like she's taking the test right now. She's doing it herself. And she. So guys, I just got tested for Corona and this is like the evidence I got tested. It doesn't make any sense what they did to me yesterday because this test is not coming out in four days and I'm also going to the campus right now. So just make it make sense to me for them not letting me get inside the school because I didn't test again inside the school. But I got tested when I was at home and something like that. And also guys, I'm waiting for the school admission because like they said they have to check in something like they're doing way too much. The end of the, mm, let me not say what I gotta say but yeah they're doing too much I have to check in for admission and after that right I'll move to the campus you guys should stay with me on late so guys I just got into the administration office and I'm waiting for my appointment because I had to stand outside for a couple of minutes but I'm happy mind didn't take as much because I had like people seeing this dude outside for two hours or something but mine just was so bad and I'm lucky well, let me know why they have me inside because I said I have something missing. I hope I don't go back home today. So stay tuned. So guys, after going to the financial, whatever the fuck they, <laughs> they wanted me to go through. And they said I have to go through the health. Right, so they went to check my health form and they said they didn't find my health form that I did. And I even completed it on time. So I don't know what's wrong with this people. This is why I'm so disorganized. If I knew this, like most of the HBCU schools, they are so fucking disorganized. Like, how don't you see? I have to wait half an hour again for them to get my health form because the person that is meant to check my health form again to recheck it went on a lunch. So I have to wait. This is what I'm doing right now, resting. Like, two days just to move in. Like, two days. They don't even care about, oh, if my sister is working, if my parents are working. What? Like, oh my gosh, this is so, like, I'm so tired. Like, even the campus, they're even making us to go through this, doesn't even deserve that high. So tired, like I'm in the car right now. And I have like 12 minutes for me to wait for the winning. And hopefully it was, because if they send me back home, I'll tell them to give me back my money, I'm not going again. Like, what the hell? Even Harvard never does this type of shit now. I'm not comparing, but you know, you already know the vibes. Charlie tired, I'm sitting in the car chilling. Look at my sister. Alright guys, see you guys if it finally works out. Look at my chain, dream, dream, oh dream shit, hey, look at that shit, ooh, hey. So guys, my sister and I is just living in the office and stuff like that. And I'm gonna tell you guys what happened. Is it, is this dog really? <laughs> I thought it was loud. So, <coughs> Let me claim my voice or claim my voice up for this story. So this is what they said. They said that my sister got tested for COVID-19 and she got tested negative, right? 14 days ago. No, not 14 days ago, like a few days ago. And the results has to be like 14 days ago. And hey guys so this is the end of my video back to school gone wrong because um they sent me back again and i couldn't record it yesterday but to relax bro what i do what i, I, I do just relax let me tell them because like i took my covid test but they needed it to be 10 days prior to the day of my moving but it was already like more than 10 days and also they have to figure out my health tests and everything so i'm gonna go back to school once my covid test is done my doctor sends um, my refill and everything and i'll go back to school and i'll you know i'll record me going back to school my official moving day because this moving day was just like a pure mix i'm going to tell you guys a story time what happened everything that happened how it was crazy how unorganized hbcus uh, hbcu schools are most of them you know 
you already know what I'm talking about about HBC. Historical Black College University. So guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you dropped that like button. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to turn on your post on my post notification. On your post notification. And follow me on all my social media on Instagram and TikTok and Twitter at so underscore candy. Let's get late. Oh crew. Love you guys. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Mm -hmm. Bye.